It's showtime! No, that's not right. It's showtime! It's, it's showtime! Dad, what are you doing? Oh, uh, hi, Dash. Just practicing my superhero catchphrase whenever I meet a bad guy. <sighs> Dad, I'm trying to sleep here. I got a test tomorrow. Oh, right, sorry. Mr. Incredible can't be incredible without his muscles, so every morning I illegally trespass into the train yard to work out. Now, you may be asking, why not just go to the gym? But quite frankly, the gym membership costs way too much studs. But thankfully for me, I have an interview later with the ambassador of the city, which pays 1,000 studs. Just enough to buy the membership. Anyway, before I head back to my house, I practice my bad guy getaway chasing skills on the interstate. No bad guys are going to escape from me on my watch. 7am, I drive the kids to school. Or, well, I drive Violet to school. Dash just runs beside the vehicle till we get a couple blocks away. Then he hops back in like nothing happened. I'm kinda surprised no one's gotten suspicious of it yet. After I bring them to school, I head on over to the police department to see if there's any local crime to stop. And it turns out, there was. It's showtime. Thank you, Mr. Incredible. No pro- No, no pro- No- Oh, come on! Seriously? <laughs> Between 10am and 11am, I take a well-deserved break from hero work. I use this quick break before lunch to sail the high seas on my beautiful boat Helen got for me last Christmas. I named it Elastiboat after her. Wait a second. I'm almost late for my lunch with her! Hi, honey. <laughs> what? What's so funny? Huh. Okay. I guess I'll never know. Me and Helen sat down for a nice relaxing lunch at the Happy Platter, which, may I remind you, just has the finest of tap water this side of the city. I still didn't find out why she laughed at me though. 1pm. I still got some time before my interview with the ambassador later, so I might as well put my strength to good work. I headed over downtown to help clean up the city and do some community work. And while I did clear up a lot of junk, for whatever reason people started laughing at me which only made me distracted. And that only led me to accidentally shoving a car into the water. <clears throat> My bad. But seriously, what is up with all this laughing? At 3pm I decided to let off some steam at the monorail station. I find it very relaxing to attempt to use my strength to stop the monorail from moving. I've never stopped it before, but I can feel it in my veins. This is it, I will stop it this time. All my life has came down to this- I didn't stop it. My stomach was starting to growl after all this work, so I decided to head over to the pizza store for a quick bite before my interview at 6, where I'll hopefully earn enough studs to buy a proper gym membership. And that's when I saw the promotion the store was running. Deliver a pizza, get one pizza free. What a deal! I couldn't turn this down. So I grabbed a pizza and hopped into my vehicle and headed towards the delivery location. It was in the residential district, but my time was running low before I had to meet the ambassador. And that's when my driving skills from earlier came into play. Albeit, I wasn't exactly chasing a car down, but still. Never underestimate your skills on the road. Hi there, delivery for custom A? Yeah, that's me. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, sorry, nothing. Of course, I had no idea why he was laughing, but there was no time to think. I had only a couple minutes before my interview with the ambassador at City Hall, and I still needed to head back and pick up my pizza. So much for being on time. 6 p.m. Finally, time for the interview. Oh, hey, sup, Frozone? Sup, Bob. You ready for this? Yeah, I've been preparing all day. <laughs> Uh, what's so funny? Bob, you're wearing your pajamas. No, I'm not. <laughs> <sighs> so that's why? Uh, next up, Mr. Incredible. Oh, come on. It's showtime. No, that's not right. It's make sure you put on your super suit this time. 